At least 5,000 people benefited from free surgeries and medical attention courtesy the USNS Comfort, a U.S. naval ship which docked at Brighton Le Bray in Trinidad over a period of some days to assist in medical procedures to Trinbagonians as well as migrants. Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley said the ship was more than what he expected. 5,000 persons benefited from free surgeries and medical attention courtesy the USNS Comfort, a U.S. naval ship which docked at several points in Trinidad over a period of some days to assist in medical procedures to Trinbagonians as well as migrants. Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley said the ship was more than what he expected. It was immediately accepted and the arrangements were put in place and we anxiously awaited the arrival and they were here and on time and it is more than we expected. The, the, the floating hospital comfort is a, a marvel of medical services. I told them, I told the ship this morning and it is in fact a real hospital and I think that um, we were lucky to be included in the program. However, Dr. Rowley said the USNS comfort services does not mean our public health services aren't sufficient. We have a very good health service in Trinidad and Tobago and healthcare is always required in all forms and fashion. And the, the, the fact that we are having additional inputs like this is no indication of failure. It's an indication of additional support and additional service. The USNS Comfort embarked on a five-month tour of the Caribbean and spent 10 days in Trinidad and Tobago. Charlene Lewis, TTT News.